Now part two then ladies of this lovely happy mail that I've received from Angelica Schlager. Um, I'm just a bit overwhelmed by all of this. Um, she sent so much to me and I really am grateful. Um, I just can't tell you how grateful I am. Angel, it's lovely. Now she sent me a really good selection there of stamps, beautiful stamps from everywhere everywhere so thank you for those Engelhorn's uh, Alemannia Roman Bibliotheque <laughs> hard to get your teeth around oh that's lovely lovely old old book there lots of pages oh I must admit I don't know the language I know snippets and that's that's as much as I know lovely to read it all looks like a pretty old book too so thank you for that I love books I just love books I just want to sing that I think we all know the story of Sinbad, Sinbad the Sailor, his adventures. Lots of illustrations in there and a uh, lovely old book again, vintage book there. And here we've got some um, the, the deco stickers. <coughs> I won't touch them out of the back. And here we've got <coughs> a brown envelope. It's uh, more ephemera. Oh, lovely, 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 lovely. Now, I love these filigree metal pieces. And they're lovely to include in a journal can absolutely do anything with them. They're lovely. Thank you ever so much for that. I do appreciate it. <coughs> right, some fancy buttons. Some wooden butterflies. Some more metal. Another butterfly. <laughs> Excuse me. Coughing, I've been eating nuts, I've got them stuck in my throat. Right. Oh, some washi tape. That's lovely. Different uh, types of washi. That's the dark. The toy. Oh, lovely. Some old postcards. go through these again afterwards uh, more slowly. Um, I like old postcards again. Uh, I like social history so I'm really pleased with those. Ooh. We've got some sticky books there. No, I'm not keen on bugs and I'm definitely not a fan of spiders. Definitely not. I was stuck upstairs the other day for an hour. I couldn't come downstairs because there was a spider on the stairs. 
So I have to wait for my husband to come, <laughs> come in and take it outside. That's how bad I am. Oh, terrible. I've never got out of it. I've always had that sort of phobia. Don't know where it's from. I don't know anybody in the family who's got a phobia about spiders. So I think you bring it back with you into the next life if you were afraid before. I think you bring things back. That's unusual too. You don't see that anymore. You used to see uh, little transparencies to protect photographs. In days of old and night of old. It's lovely. just love to live somewhere like that where it looks so clean and crisp and everybody looks healthy and great and lovely. So thank you for those, that beautiful. Um, right, we've got a, a little uh, pile here of, oh how lovely. Angel sent me some doilies. Always welcome. Always. I love handwork. And any description. And another one. Another embroidered piece. Here she sent a selection of napkins and I absolutely love napkins, I love doing decoupage and these are just lovely. So we've got birds, roses, two of those, we've got pale pink roses and that one. Again, botanicals on those two. These are lovely, I've got none of these, not seen any of these. It's lovely and delicate, isn't it, with the bird as well. That's lovely. Now I'm feeling a bit better. I'd better get my head down and, and do some work, I think. It's lovely. It's very Christmassy, isn't it? A couple of those. And that's sweet with the cherubs on. Gorgeous. Thank you ever so much. And in here, she's wrapped something else. in a, a hanky with bud roses on it and their little trims it's a sort of a, a maroon brownie maroon colour lovely piece of tulle uh, unusual it's blue on blue on black which is an unusual colour isn't it blue on black Beautiful. And that's unusual. I've not seen anything like that before. That's lovely. Little piece of vintage lace. And another. That's lovely. As I say, I'm a bit overwhelmed because she sent me such a lot um, and it's just so lovely of her to send me happy mail. And we're finishing up ladies with <coughs> a piece of, a lovely piece of fabric, it's a real heavy cotton, real heavy, make a lovely book cover. Beautiful. 
and this piece oh, it's an Australian design um, and it's got part of uh, part of Australia showing the, the, the southern tip about Melbourne and then Tasmania uh, not long ago I did um, th there was a bonnet project um, going all over the world called Roses of the Heart um, and it was organised by a lady who lives in uh, Australia and uh, she was asking for needle ladies to make bonnets um, they were, it was a memorial that they were doing to uh, all the unfortunate ladies um, who were prisoners in England and sent over to Australia and long ago and some died on the way some managed to to get through it all but really t to preserve the memory of those ladies and the awful times of slavery and uh, well it wasn't slavery it was um, they were prisoners they might have stolen a, a piece of bread um, they'd get hanged for it a sheep, stealing a sheep, but if it was something like uh, me more menial, like um, stealing a loaf of bread or fruit, they would be sent to Australia uh, and and uh, imprisoned there. Uh, so that was a project that um, was close to my heart, really. That's a lovely, lovely image there. But uh, going back to the story, um, the lady who was um, doing this project, I don't know whether she's still doing it, it went all over the world like I say, she got thousands and thousands of bonnets and uh, I think there was a museum being set up to house them, they did do a touring exhibition of them, there was one at Birmingham at the NEC. Oh, it, was, it was heartbreaking really to, to look at them all and you decorate it, it was a typical um, old fashioned bonnet made of um, calico and you decorated the bonnet uh, in your own style what, did whatever you want and you put the name of a lady you took a, the name of a lady from the shipping lists and it was dedicated to that particular lady and it was a really interesting project to do. We've got some more ephemera here. I like drawings. Lovely. And to finish off ladies we've got uh, a magazine. Glass costumes. And this is interesting because um, It's all in uh, German, and it's lovely to see their fashions and, and how they lived. What a lovely! Looks typical twenties, thirties. That's interesting on the map. I've loved every little bit of this angel. I've absolutely loved it. It's uh, so interesting to see uh, ephemera from another part of the world and uh, to receive kindness from someone who you've never met, um, hardly know but she's a lovely lady and do pop and see her channel Angelica Schlager and see what she does thank you everybody for looking in and uh, having the patience to sit with me and go through it bless you bye for now ladies bye